Another year and another chance to watch this franchise be tombstoned into oblivion. They're not gonna explain why Salem never used her infinite army to begin with, are they? Without you, I am nothing. Oh, Cinder, honey, you're already nothing. Is this the season where we'll finally get a fucking backstory and motivation for Cinder? I mean, it's not like it matters. This character is a complete joke at this point, but it'd be something, I suppose. She's done here, she'll move on to the rest of Remnant. There are people here who need us right now. We need to warn them! Okay, let's go for- oh, You don't say! It's almost like James was trying to do this, and because of all you retards, it became part of why he went crazy! So, basically, we're still having the same kind of dilemma, right? The needs of the many and the needs of the few? Ah, fuck it, who cares at this point? Okay, let's go for both. Get Amity up and running and evacuate Nancy. Had that opportunity last season, you frumpy troglodyte. So, getting Amity up and running it is a priority now? It'd be sad if it weren't so funny. Also, you think Salem is gonna let you? Actually, she probably would, given it's taken her this long to use her Grim Army in any logical way. Why are the Aesops still here? They got a burial so brutal that it makes the Nexus smell like roses. Are they now on the moronic side? Will they fight them again? Who knows and who fucking cares? They were a fucking waste to begin with. I also laughed at the part where Crow holds Clover's pin. He's dead because of you, and then you blamed James for it. You brainless ham. And oh boy, Penny will do maiden things, guys. Can't wait for no explanation as to how Penny is a maiden in the first damn place. But I'll rant about that when I get to volume seven. Eventually. I have questions for you. But first I need the one who can show me how. Oh, a super Grim! Why should this matter? Grim are pretty much a joke and Ruby can nuke them with no downsides. But Oscar might be captured, guys! You care about Oscar, don't you? You don't want him to be kidnapped. Well, that was a bunch of nothing. Not like there's much to be excited about anyways. I know people have all these predictions and theoretisms and whatnot, so I'll give a few myself. Ren and Nora will continue to not matter. Blake and Yang will largely stay irrelevant, as they should. Weiss will join Ren and Nora and fulfill her role of not mattering. Ruby will become the Ultra God Mary Sue like the prophecy says. There will be more retcons and destruction of character, and it'll probably not even be so bad it's good, just so bad it's frustrating, or so bad it's bleh. I'm on the edge of my sleep. Like, I really can't find any fucks to give anymore. I'm just here to watch the train crash.